Welcome back fellow engineers, I am the Neural, this is Factorio and I've just recorded a 5 minute clip without actually recording it. I am taking back what is rightfully ours. <laughs> I am securing these resources, just took down a, a huge, well a big, a reasonably big base. Oh crap 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 crap. Uh, kill 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 kill. Okay, a reasonably big biter base, uh, and uh, it is not on video because I am an idiot and didn't press record, apparently. Didn't press record. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, so uh, while we, we do this, I'm going to... Uh, whoa, whoa, where are the things? Here they are. Yeah, there you go. Uh, while we do this, well, after we do this, we're going to be setting up a train array, a train thingy, to secure these resources. We're gonna have a small mining outpost here, uh, and I'll show you how the rest of the plant is doing, because it is extremely power hungry and extremely resource hungry. It is uncanny, the amount of power required to... Uh, to actually keep this thing functioning. So we're gonna need a bunch of mines here just pumping everything we, we can up there. Uh, so I'm going to extend the... actually make walls surrounding this place just like this. Whoops, not exactly like this. Set up a small mining outpost and then uh, see if we can uh, set up a decent uh, train system to deliver the resources up there. So, I will meet you back here in just a little bit. Okay, so uh, I'm here to grab more walls and you can see this big electrical park we have here, this solar park, and you can see that we're not producing enough of the blue science packs because we don't have enough uh, smart inserters, because we don't have enough circuits, because we are producing circuits here, but as you can see, if we look at it uh, from, clo from a closer setting thingy, uh, we don't have enough copper. We're not producing enough copper to put all of these at work full speed. Uh, afterwards, we're probably gonna we're gonna need to do that, and probably going to need to put some really fast transport belts here. I'm also gonna probably get rid of these steam engines because they're just for causing pollution uh, but yeah we have enough accumulators to last us through the night uh, see here we don't we're not smelting enough copper or, or better yet we we can smelt enough copper than the one we than the copper we have so yeah this is a, a big uh, a big domino effect here so I whoa player inventory full Okay, make all the walls. Make all the walls and shove some of these back in. Just because. Alright, so I'm gonna get on with securing that place. Uh, uh, securing that place down there and I'll be right back with you. Alright, everybody. Whoops. Whoa. Uh, I don't know. What do we want? Character logistics slot. Automobilism. Flammables. Hmm... I have no idea. Speed modules. Alright. Speed module. Let's go. Uh, so, for, in order to make a diesel locomotive, we need 15 engine units. For the 15 engine units, we're gonna need this, and we have to make it in an assembly machine. So, we need that. And I'm doing this, I I'm not sure if I already told you, because we need to, to, um, we need to get all these resources figured out because if we run out of them because we need to automate the production of these guys uh, of solar panels and accumulators so that we can build the, the robo ports uh, that will build these guys because the robo ports take up a lot of power there okay so we're gonna have to first start making engine units <coughs> engine units require steel pipe steel plate and iron gear wheel so what we can do is, let's grab some steel from here, 
And let's make a bunch of a bunch of these guys. Some steel from here. Mm, let's give it one more there. And this, like that. And like this, that, that's perfectly fine. Steel. Oh dear lord, am I out? I am out. Okay, make some more. Screw it. Uh huh. So we're gonna need that. Pipes. Let's make the pipes first. So we're gonna need assembly machines for to make the pipes. Uh, do we have any on us? We do not. We do not. Yeah, cancel. Just cancel all that. Just cancel all that because we can just grab some express transport belts from here. Yeah, grab these. These and these. Okay. Uh huh. <clears throat> now we're gonna make pipes. We might. We can use these. Let's use these. Uh, yeah. These lines right here to make pipes. Where are the. Let's just pick it up from here. Yeah. Okay. So, assembly machines. These will make. Whoops. Pipes. Uh, where are the pipes? Right here. Pipes. And they'll. <laughs> Let's actually put a couple of them. Let's see. How are we on power? It's getting dark and the accumulators are up to full, so we still have some leeway. Uh, okay. <clears throat> well, let's actually put them in the middle. So, uh, speed modules. Productivity modules. Let's do it so that then we, we can use the, the alien science packs and gain free science packs with the productivity thingies. Uh, no, clear. So, copy, copy. That is correct. There and there. Alright, so you're making pipes. <clears throat> now, for the engine units, we're gonna need pipes, steel plates, and iron gear wheels. So, we, what we can do is, instead of diverting stuff from there, we can make this make iron gear wheels. So you can make, is it here? It is. Iron gear wheels. <clears throat> and both of you are going into one conveyor belt and the steel will go into the other. So let's do it like this. Okay, okay, okay. The, that's how how we're gonna do it. Uh, steel. Let's actually plop you down. You're gonna need to place some. Exactly, exactly like that. So this will be the steel input, and do we not have? And this will be the iron gear wheel. Let's actually have two of these, like that. Uh, now, all we have to do is pull the steel from down here. Come on. Oh, seriously? Uh, I have express ones, don't I? I do. So, let's place the express ones. Yeah, just like that. That's perfectly fine. That's actually just for the sake of purdiness. And grab these. Okay. Uh huh. And you are going to make. Uh huh. Engine units. Engine units. Exactly. So just pull these guys from here. Like that. And just power it up. And the engine units will go into a chest. Let's actually have a smart inserter here. Do we have any? We do. We do. And let's put them whoa, into a chest, smart chest, and power it up, just like that. 
and a, a little bit of wire and you can filter out the engine units on the condition that there are less than let's say 50. Oh dear lord that that is very very slow we're gonna need more than that. We're gonna need more okay I'm gonna set up uh, another one or two of these and I I will be back with you. Okay everybody now we're pulling more power from this and I maybe I should really automate these guys first and then take care of the the railways but what the hell I, I'm kind of scared that we'll run out of resources so now we can build these and well that was quick that was quack yeah uh, fast and quick uh, but we also need straight rails and curved rails now these require stone uh, iron plates and steel plates uh, or better yet iron sticks so we're gonna have to automate these buggers too <laughs> so we're gonna use this we're gonna use this to automate the uh, the thing and what do we need for electric engines electronic circuits engine units and lubricant okay we'll, we'll we'll figure that out later on but for now let's automate the rails part yeah here it is we have stone we have the steel here we have these things here we can make iron sticks with them stone we have here so i'm gonna make a little setup in this area right here and i'll be back to you in just a little bit okay everybody i've set up this little bit right here for the rails and now we're gonna start setting up the tracks uh, and uh, i think we're gonna have two trains one giving us some copper ore which will run over to there ish maybe kinda i'm not sure yet and another for iron ore which might actually stop here so I uh, th this I haven't fiddled around with this yet no not not quite yet so I think let, let's try to do it like this and then we're gonna have a train stop where is the train stop that I built probably here a train stop okay okay I'm I'm getting the point the picture I'm getting the picture uh, let's uh, let's get rid of these little buggers and make as big a train uh, as much room as possible for for the train well actually it'll have to come around afterwards so let, let's see let's see how this turns out let, let's get ourselves some of these guys okay 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 Hmm, so we're probably gonna need more like this and then uh, oh okay okay this can't be so then like this hmm is it like that uh, must be must be oh okay like this and then only then like this all right all right i i'm seeing let's see if we can if we can actually no yeah like that and then like this okay okay this is this is fun this is neat like this Okay, and I wonder if... Ah, just barely, just barely, but we can fit it in here. And we'll power this up like this and like this. Okay, and then it goes back, it goes back. All right, all right, I'm getting the picture here. So I'm gonna set up the rails and then we'll figure out if we can't insert some logic into this place because I think we can. Okay, everybody, I have been at this for a few hours. I ended up having to resort to YouTube to understand what 
how this thing worked because I wasn't able to get it functioning until I realized that I don't need signs, I don't need traffic signs for, for this bit because there's only one train. Uh, there is a tutorial if you want to have more than one train running the, this place, there is a tutorial online, a let's play by Enzania, uh, which shows you how to do it. But uh, for now, this is what we need. No signs at all and just this. Actually, uh, do we have lights? We do. Let's let's grab a couple of lights. Let's put one here and uh, there. So we have one, two, three, four, four uh, thingies, mines. <laughs> and these ones, le let's actually get even more copper going. Uh, now, let's see our electric demand here, mm, going down pretty fast, so we're gonna need more power and we're gonna have to deal with these sooner or later, but I've been doing a ton of research and now we have poison capsules, slowdown capsules, defender and destructor capsules, so we'll see how that goes. And now all we have to do is RK84, let's say 30 seconds, and then Tyler Burns let's say 30 seconds the train is filled uh, filled up with with coal or fuel so let's tell it to go now it'll be it'll stay here for 30 seconds and afterwards we shouldn't really be on the tracks cuz it's dangerous when this thing leaves these inserters will start filling up these chests r right here and there is n there is uh, there isn't any chest here i don't know why must have missed it there so these will start uh, filling up these chests oh these are too much mm, okay and now the train leaves and let's see how far down our accumulators went overnight down to half so yeah th that's that's pretty good and now the real show starts. <laughs> uh, see this? I put some chests in the middle here too, because uh, we need alien science packs. I already researched. Uh, rocket shooting speed, rocket explosive rocketry, effects explosive rocket. Okay, whatever, <laughs> do it. Because uh, see, these aren't placing anything. So, why aren't is this already empty oh right these were the ones that that were full uh whoop, no i don't want that uh huh okay so now this thing will start flowing <laughs> uh this is so cool and the train will be on its way let's actually catch it down there and see how far back we need those inserters to to be so we have two rows of inserters that aren't really doing anything so these aren't really doing anything and let's plop you down there and <laughs> you and you <laughs> all right and we can actually add one more row Hmm. This thing really isn't okay. Let's let's add more mines to this thing. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go grab some more mines so, so we can see this uh, completely in action, full action. Well, everybody, it seems that this will never see. These will never get uh, filled up, and these these conveyor belts are completely chock full. Uh, it's really amazing, actually. Uh, cargo wagon. Is there nothing there? Nothing's there. Okay, so these are empty. <laughs> uh, it's uh, it's funny because we're, we're we're at full speed production now. Yeah, the all of this was completely worth it. Man, the game is slowing down to a standstill. Ah, there you go. Uh, yeah. And actually, fun fact, the engines stopped running because we ran out of coal. So we no longer actually need the engines. Our pollution levels hopefully will start to dwindle. I don't, I don't understand how the hell we're so dirty. 
Hmm. Yeah, I really don't don't understand how we we managed to be so dirty, but all of this can actually go now. Ooh, explosive rocketry. Hmm. We can't research this, nor this, nor this. Bullet damage too. Okay, whatever. <clears throat> but yeah, we are. <laughs> we're very. Uh, wow. <laughs> this is very good news. So now <clears throat> we can start focus. We can start producing, automating production of these things, uh, of the solar panels and the accumulators, and then start producing. Wow, we're gonna need processing units and uh, what does this do energy this sh should be for the modular armor uh, we can build a rocket launcher let's build a rocket launcher screw it <laughs> and then we're gonna build modular armor and stuff like that and afterwards we're gonna take care of all of these bad guys around here uh, well actually no L let's start uh, let's make some yeah let's automate power supply first so that afterwards we we can have enough power for robo ports and start automating and making logistics go just ever so so more smoothly and uh, yeah uh, how, how much coal do you have right now oh you you didn't you didn't use up that much did you all right everybody well yeah this was fun <laughs> we have trains and then we can set the rails to go to other places that we liberate we get rid of these bases here and we can use these guys and uh, make smelting arrays uh, over here and then bring the resources over here it's gonna be great it's gonna be great so until next time thank you very much for watching i have been the neural and i hope you have an awesome day